Kelly, and she has a really unique nail tool. It's called the Crystal Katana. Kelly, please please explain the brilliance of this because I can't stop staring at it. I would love to, thank you. Um, this tool has a synthetic wax, it's my invention, and you gently pick up the crystals and place them one by one onto either your nails or any accessories. Um, I'm, I'm not a nail tech, but I glue onto everything in the world except nails. Uh, so things like the, your UV lamp you could do. Uh, we have these limited edition Crystal Katana tools uh, for our customer crystals for nails here, exclusive. And uh, so you can crystallize anything you want with Swarovski crystals. That's really cool. So, I mean, like you're saying, anything. So if I pick this up and I say, I'm gonna do my cell phone or something like that, this is the tool that I'd wanna use. The one, for sure. You just add a little glue to your surface and then you touch your crystals or embellishments and place them into the glue and press down with the other side and that's it, one by one. How did you come up with this? It's brilliant. I've done this uh, over 10 years now and I recently completed a whole uh, 1956 Porsche replica 356 with one tool to show that everybody, it, it works for a long time. It, it was uh, over 247,000 crystals on that car with one tool. So it's just a, a my profession and I had to invent a tool that would help because there was no other tool that could keep up. So do people come to you with, and like that guy who owned the car, he said, I want you to do this to my car, or like how do people find you? Uh, correct, it's all through social media. Um, if you are interested in making a gift, then it's just a, a simple Google search for Swarovski gifts or nails um, or, or for cars, and usually you'll find my company. So yeah, it's been a, quite a journey. <laughs> <laughs> how did you get started doing this? What made you want to start you know, jeweling things up? I did a lot of mosaics for many years, and this is just, to me, small mosaics. So I just kind of transition into smaller pieces, and I, I can't stop. It's like I constantly am doing projects for the Oscars and for the Olympics and tons of corporate orders, and um, I really enjoy it. Well, I did notice your shoes, because you were talking about crystallization. They are pretty spectacular. Right. How long did that take you to do? Uh, these took about 40 hours. 40 hours? 40 hours. Now, did you decide, like, what made you think you wanted clear versus a color? Um, clear, th these shoes actually match a, a uniform one of, one of my models wears, it shows. It's a full race suit, a drag race suit. Um, and so we had to go with clear just because, you know, white is it's the best, the, the most sparkliest color that I, that I like. Yeah. I love them. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much.